Hello everybody, this is 13 with Superior Mobile by 13 and today I've got Sean's 2017 F250. It is pulled out of the shop so that I can use my cell phone and the wonderful dusk lighting that we've got here to show off the favorite modification that I did to this thing, the Starlight Headliner. So before I turn it on, let me go over the basics of it. It is activated by this stainless steel little halo button right over there. For this installation, we dyed the A pillars and the C pillars so this is the a pillar die job this was like a tan color beforehand so now it's all black we also did the overhead console the only downside of dying this entire assembly we lost the button icons that were on there i was hoping that i could laser etch them on afterwards but we didn't do that because we didn't know what kind of settings to use didn't want to melt the plastic but everything else died out really beautiful and also did the uh, rear dome light there and also these hooks the b pillar got done and those handles and the C pillars were actually already black. Also worth noting is that the sun visors got dyed and upholstered. So this is stuff that I have to farm out because I cannot do upholstery work like this or dye work, but it still works. You know, everything's great. They did a great job and I'm really happy and really pleased. Let's turn this beautiful starlight headliner on. So let's go down here and push the button and then voila. This is a 700 star RGBW kit from Weedamark. It is on a color cycle mode right now and also on a twinkle on the slowest twinkle mode. So with the app that comes with this thing, you can select any of the colors. You can change the twinkle settings as well as control of a shooting star but now we did not do a shooting star on this kit the client did not want shooting star which is totally great with me because I think honestly if you do them wrong they look really cheesy so something else worth showing off is the actual installation itself so if we pull the seat down that is the starlight engine now this is all hidden behind the seat basically real simple is we just had just trimmed out for the port for the big subwoofer box and then so I just trimmed that that out too so it fits in there all of the fiber optics are behind the scenes and running up the pillars this is the result that we get okay this is it on pure white mode i'll just kind of do a nice little slow pan so you can enjoy and appreciate this beautiful thing. And here it is on red, just for fun. I'm gonna videotape from different sides of the vehicle so you can kind of get an idea for the way that it looks in all sorts of form and factors. And now we've got it in green. Looking in from the passenger side, look at that. And here it is on blue. This is uh, basically what it looks like, and I'm very proud of it. Obviously, we reupholstered the whole headliner in black suede. Forgot to say that. So the mode that I just put it on is the seven color jump mode, and then I turned off the twinkles. You know what? I think the twinkle looks dope, and that's pretty much the way that I would run it if this was in my truck. This is, by the way, what it looks like on the max speed of twinkle, and I did it on a static pure white mode. It's twinkling. It's twinkling a lot. It's a beautiful effect. I'm a big fan, but I like the slow twinkle on the seven color fade. Like here it is on the fade on super fast, and then also fast twinkle, which is, if you ask, me just a little bit too intense you know I want something soothing and calming and peaceful so here we are back to a nice slow color cycle with a slow twinkle now I did a lot of other things while I was doing the starlight headliner install on this vehicle so the pricing in the video description is going to be approximate however if you are local and emphasis on that you must be local for me to provide this service and you are interested in a starlight headliner then by all means go into the video description we'll have basic reference price point there and then you can go on to my website and there will be a build request form on that website and you can submit a build inquiry there and we can see about getting you into a future build queue currently i'm not accepting new clients however i will be again in the near future so as always thank you so much for watching this is 13 with superior mobile by 13 and you guys have yourselves a wonderful day i'll talk to you later see ya